Yeah, right, right. Ooh, hey, <laughs> how you doing? Foreign tourist, hey. I'm taking pictures. I'm, I'm obviously a public pervert over here. Yeah, I'll see you later. Oh, hey, <laughs> sorry, forget about you still being here. Uh, either way, guys, welcome back. Akiba's Trip, Undead and Undressed, episode number one. The first one was episode zero because it was more of a pro, like introduction to the game, story, etc., etc. We're going to get into some combat right now. I believe there's another little bit of a introduction that happens here really quickly before we actually go further in. Um, let's see, uh, I'm pretty much back to normal, I guess. So, you got that. You know, I'm going to get it. You know, I'm going to get it. 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 I'll try not to, but you know, if the ladies can't keep their hands off, what can I really say? I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. So they're after my clothes? So they're after your clothes, so they're after your underwear. I could get behind that one. <laughs> you know, I'm getting really tired of these accusations over here. Apparently there was a little bit of uh, evil in me a while back and now this. You need to relax, Chizuku. <laughs> Alrighty, here we go. Ah! Ah, and these are all males. Uh, that guy's got a pink bath. Don't call me a filthy failure. Who do you? Where do you get off? Ah, run away! Let's call the police. Damn. Why couldn't they just get send girls? You're telling me, right? Look at this guy with his like half grown mustache over here. You're going through puberty, pal? Not that I can really hate on it. I also can't grow an actual mustache or beard, and it really hurts. But either way, um damn, why couldn't they have sent girls? It sounds like I something that this guy would say. I guess. Are you jealous or what? <laughs> I will come and join in this battle. Alright, let me add him fighting, huh? Guess I'd better man up. Suppose I don't really have much of a choice. Well, that's actually not wrong, so we're gonna go with that one. Alrighty. First piece of combat here. You should be more than capable of putting up a fight at this point. Let's take these guys down together. So we gotta go into combat mode over here. He's got a bat. Ah, oh, Falcon, stop jumping. You're always jumping in this goddamn game. You gotta stop doing that. Alright, so. That's gonna be upper body attacks to the heads. We do some chain attacks over here as well. You wanna like, you know, help me out here? Shizuka. Synthesters have tough bodies, so physical punishment alone won't be enough to defeat them. If you... I'll show you what will, though. First, try targeting a specific article of clothing. Press Y to attack the head. Press B to attack the upper body, and that's for low. Yeah, I got it so far, game. And believe me, you, you, you did a pretty good job in the first fight. Your goal is to wear down each of your opponent's clothing and not just shirts and pants, but headgear as well. Alright, so this guy does have headgear, so we gotta remember that not all of them will have headgear, but some will. Alrighty, do a little bit of a sweep here, go back to the head. Now, the moment they start shining, well, I guess the tutorial will explain it to you. Well done, your opponent's clothes look pretty scuffed up. When you think their durability is low enough, you can try pulling them off. Just press and hold Y, B, or A to grab the appropriate part of the enemy's outfit and attempt to remove it. And those are the basics of stripping. <laughs> Why not try your hand at it? Okay. So let's go for the head here. Oh, we missed it. Hey. There we got him. Oh, we took his headgear off. Perfect. Got six experience for that as well. Now, that's the guy we've been working on here. So let's continue the assault over here together. I want to say that his middle portion is ready to go as well. Nope. There we go. Come on. Oh, he's over here flipping in the air. Shizuka, give me a second here. There we go. Upper buddies, uh, upper body clothing is gone. And I think so is the bottom one ready. There we go. <laughs> Down to your Jimmy Johns. And as you can see, that's how you would kill a vampire in this game. I know it's a bit comical, but so be it. Uh, did you know you can press and hold LB to straighten your clothes, fully recovering old durability that has been lost? I actually do know that, and it's really important. Come on, there's only one left, so let's get this over with before reinforcements arrive. Um, this guy did drop a weapon, by the way. And we got, um, what is that? Was that a monitor? 
Yeah, you can get all sorts of weird weapons in this game. Like, you could use, like, rumbuses, um, computer screens. It's ridiculous. And, like, nothing is really left as a non-usable weapon. It's pretty impressive, as a matter of fact. Let's see if we can get... Excuse me, sir. If you don't mind me, I just want to strip you down over here in public. Alrighty. This guy's down for the count. You guys want to move back over here a little bit? Oh my lord, he just went Ken Griffey on her. That's crazy. Alright, to keep with the sweeps over here. I love the fact that my dude's like a martial arts expert as well. Oh, he just... <laughs> I got some chicken kebab, though. What? How did he lose his clothing? Was that you, Chizuka? It probably was. Alrighty, I will. Or at least I, I won't forget it, that is. But I will remember. We did, somehow. I was so cut up in the moment, I barely noticed how well we were doing. Where did all this, st this strength come from? <laughs> and of course, no. <laughs> Japanese game is not complete. <laughs> Without your little sister, of course. Broski, you're alive! And she's not just staring, she's literally saying the word stare at another human being right now. She saved my life, it's complicated. Just a girl who kissed me, that's all. <laughs> Let's go with that one, sure, why not? Oh man, calling me out in public this way? How dare you, Nana? I must atone, jeez. I didn't mean to, it was out of my hands. I can do whatever the hell I want. I'm so sorry, please forgive me. I'm gonna go with the first one here. I don't want to necessarily be too much of a dick. Oh, I gotta buy you something now. Mission. Okay. <laughs> Please don't let it be expensive. Yeah, you and me both. Alright, this will kind of teach you the um, chopping aspect of the game itself. I think. There, we good? That was price or not, I'd imagine. Is it to your liking, milady? Oh, it's a good thing I don't have a fedora on. Uh, let's say, there, we good? Thank you, Nini. Protagonist! That is, I've never heard that one before. I'm not sure how I feel about that either. Being related to her is so damn expensive. Eep. そっちも覚悟した方がいいよ。早めに説明に行かないと、より危険度がマスかな。Yeah, that's a good point. それとそんなボロい服装でうろうろされるの恥ずかしい。基地に来た時に下手直してあげる。もちろんお小遣いはいただくけど、引きこもりには日中の日差しは眩しすぎる模様。ではまた基地で。可愛い妹はクールに去
for two more uh, attack power. Or we go with the monitor that dropped as well. I guess we'll go with the monitor. Now, every weapon does have a different type of, um, I guess, attack style. So some of them will be a little bit more easier to use than other ones. I'm not sure. I never used a monitor before, so I can't really um, speak to it. But we'll give it a try. Now, in terms of t-shirts over here, um, we could use some of the clothing that those guys drop. Let's see, there's a Rebel's Black Jacket, which is three defense. That's pretty cool. I gotta say, that's actually pretty badass. And we have the Stained Parka, which is uh, more durability. So, just for durability's sake, I'm gonna use this one, although it looks like, you know, we could definitely, you know, dry clean it or something. Jesus, that guy was dirty. Alrighty. In terms of pants here, we could we can't use Chisaku's dress yet, to my knowledge, but we're gonna use these acid wash jeans that we dropped as well. And, oh god, those are... Hideous. Okay, for now we're gonna rock them just for durability's sake. And sneakers, nothing else over here. Anything over here? Nope. And nope. Everyday underwear. <laughs> ah. Now, Chisaku, can I check out your? What are you looking at? I, I just wanted to. I was curious. Game. I'm gonna look at those panties one day or another. I, I guarantee you that much right now. So we can't really do much with her. Yeah, she doesn't let you in equip her yet. I'm not sure if she ever lets you, but I guess we'll find out. Um, that's cool. Alright, let's continue going forward here. We got some equipment on. It's all good. Our main objective is back to the Freedom Fighters headquarters as we're going to be heading over to right now. Alrighty. What do we have here? There goes Nana. The Mosaic Move. Sham.Studio UD+. Plus. That's exactly where we're headed to right now. So I guess um, she took a little bit of detour herself because she booked it earlier than we did. So who knows what she's been up to here. Older woman. Is this a thing in Japan to just, you know, carry brooms on her back? If so, let's... You know what? I actually would like that if, you know, more people carry, like, brooms. Like, you know, say you're walking down the street, right? There's really not much else for you to do and it's dirty. Just fucking grab a broom and sweep, you know? It'll, like, you know, civilization itself would look a lot better if we just, you know, took the time to clean around whenever we had the chance nothing else to do. I'm just throwing it out there right now. If Japan is doing that, then kudos to Japan. They're taking the initiative for a healthier, cleaner world out there. And that's something I could get behind. Alrighty, so is that... Does that guy have a backpack of an anime figure? Or an anime idol? idol? Gravaru idol? I'm not sure. I know some Japanese terms, but I'm not sure what that one is. I think it's a gravure idol? Or is that porn? I might be thinking of porn. Never mind. It is Mogra. It totally is. Alrighty, and we're going to meet the entire squad right now. So, um, this is going to be a lengthy type of conversation again, so apologies, but I won't be doing much talking here. <laughs> you don't know how right you actually are. High quality 3D next to me. Uh, I think that's what they call real women in this game. Uh, she saved my life. We're dating? Oh yeah, I can tell you were real worried. Uh, let's say we're dating. Yeah, why not? You know what? Fuck you, pops. Alright? Don't need to be a dick. What is what everybody, like, you know, embarrassing me in front of this chick all the time? How can I possibly explain this to them? Well, you gotta figure out a way, buddy. Luckily, that takes place over, you know, a little cutscene black thing there. Akiba <laughs>人の生命エネルギーという正解は事実は小説よりきなりだよ、カティちゃん。しかしあんた変なバイトに行くわ。そのバイト先で怪しい薬使われて挙句に化け物にされるって。What? You don't believe that? 
まで抜けてんのよアルティメットマヌケよマヌケヘビー級世界王者よ I gotta agree with Toko on this one. まあまあトーコ落ち着けよまあ限定グッズに釣られるなんておめえらしいとは思うがな<笑> Yeah, I was the victim of circumstance. I'm a sucker for a pretty figurine. Materialism is an alluring mistress. Let's go with, um, that's what I think I was. I was a victim of circumstance. I can't, you know, help being this dumb, I guess. So, the, don't like me, Nani, may I cook it at all? Motten, no, yo, Joko, walk up there, no, Anta. I yield, I repent my transgressions. Can you see it in your heart to forgive me? Well, that's the way the cookie crumbles. Let's go with, um, This is like a falconism right here. Let's go with the second one here. Just to see if we can spit some game over to Toko here. まあ、この二人はとりあえず放置しておくとして。まずは自己紹介でもしておこうか。僕は優と。立花優とって言うんだけど。私の名前は僕たちは通称秋葉寺警団って言って。ボランティアで秋葉一帯の見回りをしてる
怪しいのはそこですからねうん今のところはいろいろと不明瞭だがよ秋葉に化け物がいるっつう動かぬ証拠があれば警察も動くだろう Maybe the police are in on it, Pops. It's all a conspiracy, man. Illuminati type shit. So, I'm going to go to the GK and then I'm going to go to the GK. So, I'm going to go to the GK and then I'm going to go to the GK. So, I'm going to go to the GK and then I'm going to go to the GK. So, I'm going to go to the GK and then I'm going to go to the GK. So, I'm going to go to the GK and then I'm going to go to the GK. So, I'm going to go to the GK and then I'm going to go to the GK. あなたたちを巻き込むわけにはいやもう巻き込まれてるってそうだな大切な団員をわけわからん化け物に改造されちまった俺からも頼むよ力を貸してやってくれ<笑>じゃあじゃあしずくさん団員名簿に名前と携帯番号を書いてください携帯ごめんなさい私持ってないから今時珍しいななら PC のメアドでもいいですよえっとそれもうん連絡が取りづらいわね家に電話だと気まずいよね家は事情があってしばらく帰っていないので何まさかドキドキ家で少女かよ家出というわけでは泊まるところだってちゃんとあります漫画もたくさん読めるしシャワーだってあるおいおい満喫じゃねえのかそれひょっとして行くところがねえのかいうんうん何やら訳ありのようだなマスターここの2階確かガラガラ好き好きですよんああそうか寝具も一揃えあったなおいしずくちゃんよければここの2階を自由に使ってくれ遠慮なんかなしなしこうして知り合ったのもなんかの縁だし化け物のことを調べるなら君の協力は欠かせそうにないしね近くにいてもらった方がいろいろと都合は良さそうだじゃ決定いい秋葉時計団に新メンバーバブアームえうんまだ私は返事を Oh, I, I think you have, Shizuku. I'm just throwing it out there. It's not more like the type of group that would take no for an answer. So, um, I could come in here and just be like, please, for me, congrats, Freedom Fighter. Oh, don't go. Please don't go. Um, let's go with, um, please, for me. Let's see if she wants to stick around for old Falcon over here. They were. 少しの間だけ。ああ、いや。It's the Falcon Charm, man. It never fails on the ladies, that's for sure. よろしくお願いします。All righty, so, what's the plan of action now here? さてと、いきなり事件の渦中に巻き込まれてしまった。わ、お前、化け物と戦ったとか言ってたけど、今まで格闘技とかやったことあんの ?As a matter of fact, I have, Pops. Um, I was forged in the fires of Toko's Rad. I can hold my own in fighting games. Well, I can argue with the best of them. Let's go with the first one, dog, because I have fought these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. I don't think I can fight these guys before. そうだわしの知り合いが秋葉でコロシアムいわゆる闘技場を仕切ってんだけどよ一応そこで鍛えるのもいいかもしれんなよかったら紹介してやるよそう闘技場を仕切ってるってどんな知り合いだよいやー格闘技マニアが講じて管理人になっちまったらしいんだよこれがしかし闘技場は誰でも入れるわけじゃねえちょっとした試験みたいなのがあるって話だ今から連絡入れとくからお前行ってこいよあなんならしずくちゃんも一緒にどうだ強くなっておくことは無理うん瞳子も行ったらどうだ
テストなしですんなり入れそうだけどなちょっとあたしはれっきとしたか弱いレディーよ人聞きの悪い悪くない提案だね雫か瞳子どっちかを連れて行ってみるかい Alrighty, so now we got a decision here. Who do we go to the battle arena with here? Chizuku or Toko, my childhood friend here? Or the new lady in town? I could also go with Kati. Oh, that's the、um, Finnish lady right there, too, huh? Alrighty, so let's do this. We're gonna wrap it up here for this episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up, leave a like to support. Doesn't mean a lot. Stick around for episode number three. Figure out who Falcon decides to go with to the battle arena, and then we will get in some combat for sure. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up. I will catch you next time.